Today's school spotlight focuses on Fourth Baptist Christian School in Plymouth. Neil Persley takes us there. Fourth Baptist Christian School began in 1966 as an act of conviction following earlier Supreme Court cases which removed God and prayer from public schools. So our pastor at the time, uh, from his pulpit, he said we are going to start our own school because if God is not welcome anymore in the public school, then we need to have a school where he is welcomed. Fourth Baptist Christian School continues to provide a Christ-centered learning environment for grades K through 12. The mission of Fourth Baptist is to train up children really in the nurture and admonition of the Lord. We want to give them a biblical worldview. And um, what we are trying to strive is we're trying to put godly teachers in front of our kids. In addition to rigorous academics, Fourth Baptist has long been known for excellence in their music program. <laughs> They recently concluded their Christmas concert, which had over a thousand people in attendance. We did some, some sacred music, but then we did some fun music. We ended with a combined song with all of our fourth through twelfth grade students uh, with our senior high band. So there was about 160 kids on the platform singing at the end. Um, there's a lot of stuff to like about Fourth Baptist. I'd say primarily the emphasis that fourth place is on uh, biblical truths. Each, uh, each faculty member, each teacher, they really want to instill biblical truths to our students and they really care about our, our personal development. Fourth has really prepared me academically and I've been able to attain scholarships for it and um, I visited colleges and I've been able to keep up with their curriculum when I visit classes and things. Fourth Baptist Christian School continues to prepare young people for life and offer an alternative to public education. Not only do we want to develop character, not only do we want to give them strong academics, but we want them to think as God would think, and then to obey the Word of God and to live it out in their lives. In Plymouth, Neil Persley, CCX News.